Well, the Allen East Mustangs look pretty charged up in their week one victory at Van Buren as Spencer Miller and Logan Schick each rush for over 100 yards and two touchdowns apiece. Tonight, the home opener for Mike Abbey's team at the Perry Commodores making the short trip north as Coach Abbey fired up for this one as he normally is because this one started on time. Allen East ball first, second and five. Spencer Miller fakes the handoff, gives it to Logan Schick for the first down on the handoff. A couple of plays later at the Perry 40, Miller back to the air. Hits Luke Perkins, brought down inside the 10-yard line for the Mustangs. Next play, they hand it off to Caleb Smelser. Finds his way into the end zone, 7-0 Allen East in front with the cheerleaders having plenty to cheer about with relatively clear skies in Herod Lafayette. Perry ball now facing third and five, a high snap. Lummy Gardner though keeps his cool and able to pick up first down later because of a penalty, but the Commerce would have to punt. Allen East takes over near midfield, third and four. Schick with the first down, a carry for the Mustangs. But the Perry defense begins to rally. Hand off to Kyle Nichols, surrounded by Commodores. Robbie Mulcahy gets the TFL for Perry. Fourth and two at the Commodore 28. Allen East is going to go for it, but that Perry defense stops them short of the first down. At Perry ball on downs. They take over their own 22-yard line. Gardner's going to keep it. Brought down at the 40, an 18-yard gain for the Perry junior quarterback. And then Gardner hits Brandon Neal, makes a man miss. Good gain down the sidelines for the Commodores. As they're in business in Allen East territory, facing fourth and nine. They're going for it. And Gardner finds a wide open at Dylan Maxwell for another first down. Lightning strike at the quarter ends. They do resume. Allen East gets the victory over Allen East, 36-7. Allen East the victory. They are now 2-0 on the season.